Hello friends, how's it going today? I'm super psyched because we get to open up a Battle Styles Elite Trainer Box, so let's crack into it. Just like with every Elite Trainer Box, we have the awesome pack arts on the inside of the wrapping on the outside, which of course includes Tyranitar, which I love so, so much. That artwork is so cool. Then we've got our usual player's guide. It has some strategies for the cards in this set, which is fun for the single strike and the rapid strike stuff to, to read up on those. And then here are some pretty cards that I would love to have. Let's see if we can find the one I want the most. Yeah, oh, you can't really see it. The Tyranitar up here, though. The Tyranitar alternate art is the one I want the most of the whole set. We also get a rule book, but this time we have new friends on the front. I guess uh, because the single strike and rapid strike stuff is new, they probably updated the rule book for that. Here's the box itself. I really love the gradient here. There's like this orange to red gradient ombre thing going on. I really like it a lot. So here's a more zoomed in version of the Urshifu, and then on the other side is a more zoomed out version. And on the top we have the Battle Styles logo, of course, as well as on the sides. We also get four dividers for the box as per usual with one side having a more zoomed in and the other side having a more zoomed out version of the Urshifu. And with that same artwork we have this awesome set of sleeves. I'm excited to start using these. As well as a super cool set of dice. Uh, this, it's kind of hard to tell in the camera but it's got multiple tones of red inside of the damage counter dice and then the coin flip die is clear and looks really cool with that set logo on it. We also get a poison and burn marker as per usual and a bunch of energies to help you build your decks. And then our main event are these eight packs of battle styles goodness. So we're just going to crack right into them, starting with, I believe that this is single strike Urshifu. I'm still trying to get the, the lingo down, uh, but I think that this Urshifu looks really, really cool. I know a lot of people like the rapid strike one or the, or the blue one, uh, but I think the red one looks really powerful and neat. So we've got a water energy, a grum pig, single strike scroll of scorn. Oh my gosh, what an intense named card. we got a Bruxish, a Glameow, Silly Cobra, Frillish, Houndour, Scatterbug, a Cacturn Reverse, and then our rare is an Aegis Slash non-hollow. So uh, this Elite Trainer Box has a little bit of a story with it. Um, I went to Walmart an hour after it opened because that's when uh, the customer service people advised me to come so that I could maybe beat the, the scalpers today. And uh, well, today being the day that these cards are released. And uh, I did get there at like eight after they opened and there were a bunch of people just milling around and they were acting kind of funny. So I assumed that they were people who were waiting for cards and so I did not get there before the scalpers, but I was able to get this elite trainer box. So we got a heat more reverse and then our rare is a crobat hollow. That is super duper cool. I love crobat so much. A very, very awesome Pokemon. So I was really fortunate to be able to get this Elite Trainer box uh, even after being in line after all of the scalper people. And uh, I had a really great conversation with a dad who was behind me in line waiting for cards for his kids. Uh, so it was just really nice to connect with somebody in the community who wasn't there just for the money. So that was really nice. And I got the uh, Shiny Dragapult V box as well for Shining Fates. So look forward to that. Uh, so we got a Sizzlepeed, a Glameow, Galarian Slowpoke, a Bufalant Reverse. I freaking love Bufalant. Look at this artwork. Work. Wow, so cool. And then our rare is a Victini V. All right, V for victory. I love Victini so much. What a cute Pokemon. Uh, and that, that has wonderful artwork too. I love it when uh, the Pokemon V have actual hand-drawn artwork instead of uh, 3D modeled artwork. I mean, obviously 3D modeled artwork is really important too and is, is also requires a lot of skill, but I prefer a little more, a little more painterly effect, I guess. So to Koreans, Karina's focus, jeez, a Spiro, Pachirisu, Cherubi, Mainfu, Silly Cobra, a Shanks Reverse! No, this is the Shanks that is also in the uh, the fun collector's chest tin thing, uh, but with a different art, I believe. So this is fun. And then our rare is a Licky Licky non holo What a- Licky Licky is such a weird Pokemon. It's- Really, the only time I, I cared about it was in the, uh, I think it was the Dark Rye movie when that guy has a Licky Licky and then, uh, I, I kind of like that Licky Licky in that movie, but otherwise I just, I just don't really care for it. So we've got a Grass Energy, a Girder, Seedra, Fan of Waves, Horsey, Cherubi, Lickitung, Electabuzz, Esper, a Vivian Reverse, and then- oh, that's a rare too, cool. And then our rare is a Meowstic Hollow. Wow, you've never seen Meowstic looking so cool. Look at that. I love how the Hollow looks with the background too. That is really, really awesome. All right, so we're on to our last three packs, uh, and they're all Tyranitar packs, saving my favorite Pokemon for last. Some of these packs feel really weird. I don't know if you can tell just looking at them, but like the edges on some of them are really stiff and strange. Uh, so here we go with these cards. They did not want to do the pack trick today. We've got a Water Energy, a Level Ball, more Peko being all angry. We got a Tool Jammer, Main Foo, Silly Cobra, Galarian Mr. Mime, Bell Sprout, 
Onyx. We've got a Mean True Reverse. I do love that a lot. And then our rare is a Vivian non holo So we got both the holo rare or the reverse rare and the non holo today. So that's pretty cool for master set completion. I haven't completed a master set ever, actually. Uh, the, getting all the reverses just has never really appealed to me too much, but getting reverse rares is a lot of fun. So we've got a Rapid Strike style Mustard. Mustard's a very funny character. We've got Cheryl, Horsey, Mankey, Mawile, Fomantis, Remoraid. We've got an Aegis Slash reverse rare. That's pretty cool. And a different Aegis Slash from the one that we already had. I guess it's like a stance change sort of thing. And then our rare is a Conkledur non holo so we're on our last pack today. We did get one Pokemon V, so uh, I'm not disappointed about that, but it would be very nice to get at least one more sparkly thing today. So that is what we are hoping for. Sorry, I was uh, putting the pack in a weird place. So here we go. We've got a Darkness Energy, a Luxio, Spupa, Single Strike Style Mustard. Okay, so we got both styles of Mustard. We got a Fomantis, Remoraid, Cubone, Ponyard. Houndour, a Karina's Focus Reverse, and our final rare is a Conkelder non holo which I know I said Conkelder before. It's hard to pronounce this guy's name. So we didn't get anything too exciting today, but we did get some fun cards. We've got an Aegislash Reverse Rare, a Vivian Reverse Rare, a Crobat Hollow, which is very, very cool, a Meow Stick Hollow, and finally our Victini V, which I love very much. It's just, you know, you like to see a couple more Vs in a box usually. But I'll give you guys this Battle Styles booster code, kind of let us know what you got so that you know that you've taken it. So thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll catch you all on the flip side.